Welcome the hard-hitting fighter out of Cutler Bay, Florida, Holly the Champ Tillman! His opponent, an exceptional athlete, he fights out of Brazil. Both of these fighters with a chance to get into the final four. So I got some information, Ryan. It, it, Mark is disappointed, just, just didn't want to fight. <laughs> just felt it's like just, he that's, had that's it. done what he had I done. Mean, there's no other way of putting it. Uh, Things just happen in the fight world, you know. There, there's, there's been times in the UFC that I remember uh, a guy was walking down, he tripped, fell, knocked himself unconscious, couldn't get beat. I mean, it's just things that happen. It's a, you know. Well, Apollo is saying there's something wrong with his pillow, or I guess there was a, some discussion of how he was gripping it, if it was okay, and he's apparently okay to grip it the way that he is, using two hands to throw those haymakers on Tillman. Tillman with the over the shoulder move that he used in his last fight, kind of holding over his head, and both of these guys just going at it with each other. Tillman saying, hey, didn't hurt me at all as they continue to fight and square each other up. And you know what's interesting here is Marcus Brimage did not compete in the uh, Elite Eight. He has a break. It could benefit him or it could not because he doesn't stay, you know, stay warm. So now he has to get himself warm again. Well, I said, oh, and a wow. flying hit by Tillman on Apollo. Apollo coming right back and trying to throw some haymakers of his own. These are two. Ah, uh, and they got tangled up there. Two big gladiators in this sport going head to head. And now and another big hit by Tillman on the top of the head of Apollo. Apollo says, Connect, unfortunately for Apollo, as we start off right from the gecko, shooting Apollo, holding that pillow with the two hands to give him some extra power coming in, and he just threw the kitchen sink with that pillow to Tillman. Referee stopping the fight for a moment. Now they continue. And look at Tillman. See how he has that hand up blocking with the elbow? We saw it in the women's fight earlier on. That, that doesn't work. I think the best one is to keep your hand up like if you were to protect yourself in boxing or in MMA or in Muay Thai or any of these dog combat sports. That type of defense just doesn't seem to work. And the good thing, of course, about keeping your distance is you get a better chance of connecting against right. your opponent. The closer you get, the worse it becomes because you get tangled up at that point. And, and even if you put your palm out, you're in risk of endangering your wrist. I mean, if that pillow's coming at your eyes, you can push it back, get an injury there with your, with your wrist. Tillman holding his arm up, using it for defense, and throws a nice little jab there into Apollo's head. I wouldn't even go about, Ryan, of not putting, not opening my hand, but creating a fist, you know, because I don't put my fingers in danger. Apollo coming right back with some hits of his own, and he's swinging away, and that is the end of the match. And both fighters feel that they won this match. Advancing to the men's semifinals, your winner by unanimous decision in the blue corner, Holly Butcher. Till now.